What's going on guys? This is Delta 6. Thank you for joining us on another True Story Episode 5. And in this one guys, it's it's funny. So I got some footage I'm going to be uploading here in a minute, but I'm going to tell you this story right after this. All right, guys, so just last week, or this, this week actually, in the beginning of the week, we got a email in regards to people on property early morning um, trying to open up car doors. There's two individuals in a maroon car, uh, Nissan, and we've been on the lookout for it, you know what I mean? We never once thought to, um, you know, that they would pretty much be resident on the property you know what I'm saying like I don't know my mom always taught me you know don't defecate in your own yard um, but yeah guys this is insane so I'm sitting here driving through just doing my rounds and all of a sudden I see this maroon car it fits the description and um, I get out and I'm looking at the video, and I'm looking at the car, and I said, damn, there's something on this car sticking up on the driver's window above the black painted frit band on the bottom of the glass. So I wonder if maybe that was a paper or something on the dash sticking up. So I went over to this car, and it's the residence sticker, right? We got stickers on all the residence vehicles so they don't get towed. And it's the residence sticker in the same exact spot. I said, well, in the video, which y'all guys are gonna see here in a moment, there's two individuals and they both get out of the driver's door. I says, well, the only reason why that would be a thing is if the passenger door don't open and there's damage to the passenger side of the vehicle. So I walk around the car, there's damage to the passenger side of the vehicle, guys. This is insane. Like, how dumb can you be? So hopefully, guys, I'm gonna be, uh, next week we're, we're gonna keep this quiet send it to the office get everybody on the same page get all the paperwork drawn up to get these guys evicted um but yeah guys i mean i'm hoping to get some good video on that one because i don't i don't think these guys are gonna go quietly in the night or rather daytime when i show up and uh i'm 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 betting that i'm gonna taste somebody and i know i'm pitting them in cuffs until the police come so, me and, my, me and my officer, we're going to come over here when they home, and we're going to do what we need to do. So, hopefully, guys, I can put up that video um, on that, you know, especially if it's, if it's outside their apartment, it's free game. Anything inside that apartment, I technically can't pit on here because of uh, privacy um, laws on recording, but, um, yeah, guys, so check out this video and check out what I'm about to show you guys. So there is the red Nissan, or maroonish red Nissan, and there's a Dodge pickup in the video, so keep an eye on that, and there's a few other cars. But the ones I want you to look at is the Dodge pickup and the car that these two guys got out of. And if you guys look, I'm gonna do this quietly, if you guys look when I get out of the truck, you're gonna see me show you this red car with the sticker in the windshield, the damage to the passenger door, and then you're gonna see the same Dodge pickup that they walk towards. So it's a little hard to see guys, but there's a lot of damage there on that door. 
and I think that's why they couldn't get out. And then if you remember on the video, it showed a Dodge pickup and some other cars. And if y'all guys can see right down there by that brownish tan, there's that Dodge pickup right there. And then there's another car. It was in the video as well. So guys, uh, tell me what y'all think about this craziness, right? Um, there she is right over there. All right, guys. So what's gonna happen is, um, like I was saying, uh, come next week, we're gonna give it um, some time to do the paperwork and things, get them, uh, process and ready for eviction and then um, me and my guys gonna go up there and show them the video and give them a chance to admit on camera exactly that they were the idiots that did this and I'm praying they do guys because like I said we're gonna pit them in cuffs we're gonna turn them over um, you know I don't know if that they didn't really break into anything but at the least we can trespass them um, on top of evicting them and all that good stuff But I'm hoping that maybe they could do something with that. You know what I mean? Maybe with that evidence alone them going and trying to open up cars Maybe you know, there's an attempt of Something there, you know what I mean? So if y'all guys know what what we could do as far as um Any kind of law or charge or anything of that nature that's gonna going to be sticking on these guys um what do y'all guys think leave in the comments below if you think um you know they're going to get arrested for vandalism or or destruction of private property who knows right we all know law enforcement they they get videos like this and and they kind of uh stretch things out a bit so hopefully that's the case with this um and these two guys and i'm hoping they both live here i'm hoping it's not just a friend that was visiting and they did something stupid I'm hoping they both live here and we can just put them in cuffs and make that report and let the police handle it from there. So if this is your first time, um, hit that bell notification because like I said, when we go and we talk to these guys, we're going to see how it goes. And like I said, I'm going to plan on putting them in cuffs and these guys don't look like they want to go anywhere with us or wait for the police. They look like they would be the ones that kind of want to run or take off. And if that's the case, man, you come at me running, I'm in, I'm, I'm by the front door. You got to get through me, and I'm going to tase you. You're coming at me any kind of fast, hardcore, whatever. I'm going to tase you. You're going down, and you're going in cuffs either way. And then that's a charge, all right? So let me know what you guys think in the comment below. If you think that they are the dumbest people in the world doing this, Hit that like button give me a thumbs up on this video and hit that bell notification again so that you guys get the next video it's a part two of this episode and until next time guys be safe god bless and take care